Hello everybody, it is a Monday. We are just doing a one-off vlog today. We are in Caerphilly and we are going to take you around the castle. Jennifer doesn't want to be in the video, so it's fine, but uh, yeah. So we're going to go explore the castle. Come with us. Look at that portcullis, lovely. Let's go in and have a look. What's wrong with you today? Shh. There we are. We're going to go and pay and have a look round. We're going into the castle first. Some areas are closed because they're working on it and maintaining things. We will go down there later. Some interesting stuff. But in we go. Oh, she walks too fast for me, I tell you. Beware. Oh, it's the dragon's lair. Some real life Welsh dragons. Now they're perfectly safe, even though he's blowing out some, some steam. They keep them here so they don't terrify everybody of Wales. These are South Welsh dragons, South, South Wales dragons. And they are, you throw the food down to them. And they leave us alone. One virgin a year as well helps. Do you see there's a lot of work going on in the courtyard and the Great Hall? So, yeah, but we'll have a look at the rest of it. Which way do you want to go first? That way? Good. Are you going up the stairs, Jen? In a minute? There we go, we are on the, above the courtyard now. What's that? I know you can get to the top of the tower. This is fabulous. They would have shot their arrows through there back in the day if they were being attacked. But this place has got quite a big moat as you can see, so it would have been really good to defend. There's a secret area. Is it like a hidden room? Oh, I kind of missed then. Oh, yeah, so, Jen, what they would have done is if the castle was being attacked, they would have been... Oh, is there? Excellent. We will. They would have uh, defended the castle from there. We'll go in there in a minute. Oh, great. Let's have a look, shall we? Round of attack. Brilliant. Originally had three of these that exactly the same as that. Ah. That one calls the main entrance and drawbridge approach to the main entrance. So it's all the same. And that one looks straight out over the fields and the side. Brilliant. The castle was built the lake, wasn't there? The lake was face to it. Yeah. It doesn't look very comfy. That's because uh, it's all stone and wood, isn't it? But they would have had furs and cushions. Yeah. Right, it's in Welsh. 
Pause if you want to read it. Roof. This is the Lady Tower and it's raining. No, that's all right. Oh. Yeah, you can look over there, look. Some horses, some people fishing. Up there, I'm sure you could in the past. Look at the size of the lake. Okay, it's brilliant here. Art. I saw this when we were walking around and I thought, what in the freaky zoid is that? But it's just a, a night. I'll show you quickly because the battery's going, we won't have long left. Yeah. You try and hold up the southeast tower. Some of the defensive stuff, and it works. Sorry, Jen. And when they have reenactment days, they seal off the area from people, and they actually fire cannonballs into the lake. But it all works. It's amazing. Taking photos with my camera. This might be it because the battery's about to go. If I can, I'll show you a few other bits of Caerphilly history as we walk around. The castle is not open completely because they're working on it, which is great. We will come back and do a tour when it's fully open again. And we'll bring Paul next time. So that's it, it's starting to rain. Um, it's quite heavy for a bit there, so we're going to head off home. We'll be back to Caerphilly and we'll hopefully take you around the rest of the castle when it reopens and show you some other bits. But I hope you enjoyed this little day out with us and we'll see you soon. Bye.